Okay, our next guest is without a doubt the one we're asked the most about here on Twin Cities Live. She's done live psychic readings on lots of TCL audience members, guests, and co-hosts. <laughs> and uh, to finish out Chris Eggert's first week as co-host, we thought we'd put him in the hot seat today. We want to welcome Jody Levant to Twin Cities Live. Hi, Jody. Tell Chris what he's got to do. Align the solar plexus. Turn a little bit more toward me. Yep. Okay. Sing. No. <laughs> could, you, could you hand me my crystal ball? Yeah. Okay. I'll get it. No, you don't have my one. Card. That's shit, right? Okay. It's actually, some people use them, and I think yeah. that's great, but I don't. Okay. I just pick up the pictures that are being shown to me all about you. Okay. Okay. So the first thing is, even before I started, there's a woman, and I feel like she's related to your, your what, a woman on the other side, uh -huh. dead who's related to your wife, she could be her mom or her grandmother, she's wearing a scarf, and she's very, very little, and she's talking a lot to your wife. And I don't know if your wife gardens or if she does certain things that are like really like small, little teeny pieces, mm -hmm. but she's talking to me about your wife and some new thing that's coming for her, like a breath of fresh air, some better health, some good things that are going around, because there's stuff going around through here. And actually that's what's going on for you. You have a really big heart, and mm -hmm. there's lots of things with that in you and your life. And one of the things for you is that you need to, that's so interesting, they're jamming me. You need to be able to start speaking more about what's happening in your heart. So you need to speak about when you're happier, you need to speak about when you're sad. The thing that's going on for you right now is you're really, really happy in your life. Uh -huh. This is a really good thing for you, you feel really good about it. <laughs> they're, they're, sh they're showing Thanks, you something. Elizabeth. I don't know where you've been with sports because I didn't look at anything about you. Yeah. But it seems like there were some things that you just, you feel like you struck out in. Like you mm -hmm. just never, that was just never something that completely came to you like you really wanted. Is that true for you? You really wanted to do well, uh -huh. really well, and it didn't work for you in the way that you really wanted it to work. That might be true. Yeah, that's pretty true. Mm -hmm. So, and. <laughs> I told her. <laughs> <laughs> so, the reason they're showing me that is that this time you struck. You didn't strike out, you struck gold. Because you're doing something that you followed your heart with. So you're gonna be offered some really odd things that are gonna be related to the show. And that might even have to do with some restaurants and you're gonna to wanna to say yes to it because it's gonna be a big money. But the big thing is you're gonna wanna mm -hmm, yeah. and bring in money for this. But you're gonna to wanna to follow this because you have it. What happens for you if somebody confront, confronts you with something, you go like this. Uh -huh. Inside, you go like this. And you don't wanna hurt people's feelings. Again, this is about the heart. You don't wanna hurt people's feelings. It's not that you don't have a big mouth because you really can. If you ask your wife, she'd tell you for sure. Oh yeah. But because with her, you really speak up and speak out. So those higher energies around you want you to do the same thing for her, around that you do with her is really speak up and speak out and be silly and do those really goofy things. But do it more in your life, in your work. So speak out about what you want. You have to speak out because otherwise you're going to strike out. The other thing is, is you can be just a total goofball at home, but you used to be a dork and you don't ever want to look like a dork. Thank you. <laughs> So, I don't know don't, if we can so what, what's that the, here. So what's the bot, don't so, be a dork? So you used to think of yourself as sort of dorky. Do you, oh, yeah, is yeah. that like a term that anybody understands anymore? Yeah, it's, I'm it's, picking up what you're throwing But do down. you understand what I'm saying? Uh -huh. You're so not. Like, it's the opposite now. People tease me about my hair, now my hair it's is It's not like dorky, that. it's beautiful. But you're beautiful. So what people used to tease you about is exactly what's popular for you right now and is exactly what people are looking at and that sparkle inside of you. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Okay, so. Thoughts, Chris? How are you uh, feeling? Well, you know, you I think a lot of that, what you said, is, is right on. So. Are you skeptical? Were you skeptical of Jody when we first told you you were going to get a psychic reading? I sometimes feel like um, some of this is you just can look at somebody and just you have a very keen power of perception. And some of this comes from that. <laughs> but I think some of it, some of the things you said seem to come from someplace else, too. So, interesting. Okay. Let's do more later. Oh man. Oh, boy. Wow. Wow. This is getting heated in here. Especially about that little boy. Huh. Okay. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, Jody, that you want to say real quick? Yeah, that is about the little boy. But you do have, there's a lady around you, and I think it's your mom's mom or grandmother. Hmm. And she keeps trying to talk to you, and I feel like she keeps tapping you. And who used to get bloody noses all the time? Sorry, that's kind of gross. Uh, I do. Yeah, she's talking about you. Huh. Wow. Okay. And there you have it. <laughs> Can we get that margarita back over here? <laughs> Jody, thank Jody, you very much. Very interesting. Thank you. Thank you. She'll be back. Don't worry. Okay. She good. stops back often. So Jody's a guest speaker for the Food for Your Soul benefit on June 20th. We have more information on the event on our website. Just go to TwinCitiesLive.com and click on Fun Margarita, everybody, and more TCL to come.